I'm in St. Peter's in Rome uh, on my way out of the Basilica. A couple of thoughts in my mind. I thought I'd share with you and see what you think because I'm trying to put together two things I can't quite reconcile in my mind and my heart. So before being in St. Peter's, we had a tour of the Vatican Museum and the Sistine Chapel. Certainly a wow. And being here in sort of Catholicism ground zero makes me think about a couple of things. Firstly, the awesome nature of what I'm seeing here, the, the grandeur, the majesty, the huge sculptures, the massive paintings, the things in the Vatican Museum, the Sistine Chapel, the depiction of the Christian story from creation through to judgment. It, it is amazing. And the, and the artistry of Michelangelo and others, the, we're seeing the best of the best of the periods that were, that were doing these sculptures and painting these frescoes and so on. Seeing all that, in a sense, dedicated to, the, to Christ, uh, bringing the best of artistry and that kind of thing, uh, there's value in that. And some of the grandeur of the building and the fact that many would have come in here over the centuries and been awed and perhaps been drawn closer to the, uh, the nature of God in some way. And even now I could imagine myself coming in here, perhaps when it was quiet, to pray or sing or just to spend moments of quiet uh, with God. I, I could see that. But then again, there's the gold. There's the well. The Vatican Museum, according to our guide, takes in 800,000 euros a day in ticket sales. 800,000 euros a day. That's a lot of dosh. And although it's understandable that uh, museums have upkeep and, you know, museums, it, it seems okay to charge a fee, is it right for a, 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 the Vatican, for a Christian organization to be involved with that kind of thing? So I, I don't pretend to know all the answers to that or I don't know what the justifications would be even, and so I'm not going to judge anybody with all this, but it, it's one of those things that's being in a place like this that is a bit of a, how do I put these two things together? The gold, the wealth, the priceless nat nature of so many things in the Vatican, Sistine Chapel, how could you put a price on that? The things I'm seeing here, the sculptures, there's the wealth, but then there's also that sense of awe. How do you put those two things together? I'd be interested to know. I'm, I'm in that moment of the being here right now where I can't reconcile these two things. There's, there's, there's paradox, this paradox is with me right now. So let me know what you think. I'd be genuinely interested to see what you have as a reflection on these issues. Take care.